Maybe I can do that, I don't know. She's cutting toenails. There she is. Now. Now. We could do maybe this. I bought a lot of corn, so if you want to take some home with you. Oh, not you go to read? I sure did. I sure did. Okay. Oh. Um, the funny guy is on making comments about mail co about train to talk. Who's what are you talking about? Uh, the mic's on now. Oh dear. Um. Okay. Who are your star dogs today? Uh, good dogs. Oakley every day, all day. Did Oakley. You see who asked that? That's a pretty dog. He's a beautiful. Dog. He's a beautiful dog. Is right. Carlene. What? Did you see who asked that question? No. Oh, <laughs> okay. A guy named Steve Gerard. Ah, <laughs> uh, nice. Yeah. Hey guy. Okay. <laughs> oh, he thinks he's a uh. All right. Nice to you. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> Chaos. What? Stop. It's this foot. Chaos. Stop. Chaos, mind your manners. You're on camera. And you stay out of there. Paula. You stay out of it, Paula. Don't go in there. Steve also asked what time is trainer talk? And is it Steve or Megan today? Yeah, oh, girl. Your leg hurt? All done, Linda. We'll get them shorter later. Awesome better. Annie's in the house. They must be slacking Steve. <laughs> Unbelievable. You're going to miss Jean's beer and barbecue in Burroughs. BBB. -B -B. B -B -B. The triple B. The triple threat. <laughs> What time is trainer talk today? Is it Steve or Megan? Yes. Guess who? <laughs> 27 minutes ago. Yeah. He was there early. Yeah. Yeah, I and mean. He's three, yeah, hours, but, he's three hours behind. No, I know, but that's still a half an hour. Yeah. He's been sitting there watching this and we didn't get there, so. <laughs> you got nothing to bet, better to do, Steve? Oh, oh. Keep reading. What did he say now? No, no, they're plenty of good questions. <laughs> oh, go back there. to the top? Go to the yeah. top. The top. I go to back to the top. Brush it. My dog has loose poop. What should I do? Stop. Get, get bigger cardboards. <laughs> what was the answer? Get bigger cardboards. <laughs> Flexible cardboard helps too. Right. Okay. So come on, give us some news. I mean, what are you up to? Yes, yeah, Steve. You take. We'd like we'd like a report, please. Yes. Yeah, In twenty-five words or less. I'm waiting. Yes, yeah, Steve, what have you been up to? What are you doing? Up to and I don't think you're too far from that lean on me guy. I think he's living the dream. I think he's living the dream. Living a dream. Well, get back to work. Uh, <laughs> there, there, that guy is, he's in Why? Bellingham. Well, you can find it on your computer, I'm sure, or Tanner can. Um, it is Washington, but yeah. I'm not sure. It's Washington. I think it's Bellingham, and I think that's right up at the right at the Canadian border, but it's still, Washington's not all that big, you know. <laughs> if Steve's got days off, that could, that could be an interesting thing to do. Here we go. I'm still looking for my dog leash. <laughs> aren't you in, a, Steve, aren't you in an amusement park today? That's from Tina. Yeah, Steve, don't go bungee jumping, please, with your neck. Oh, don't go bungee oh jumping. Gosh. Necks like held together by nothing. Ugh. Loose floating bones in there. You're just the thing to stretch out. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All I know is Keith Taylor really good. Yeah, right? All right. Well, we know we did because we saw the fish. Oh, they went fishing. 
No, bungee jumping. Oh, bungee jumping. jumping. Lean on me is on Facebook. Somebody tells us. Well, we know that. We know that. <laughs> okay, so where in the world is it on the map? Yeah, where in Washington are they? I think it's. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's. Pretty sure it's Bellingham because that's where I ended up going there one day. We're having a great time headed down to camp area tomorrow. Lean on me place would be at least a seven hour drive from here, there. That's Mr. Bears. Well, that's kind of a bit much. Yeah, Washington's bigger than you think it is. Okay, is that all? That's all. That's all, folks. That's all, guys. I'll be here all week. That's, there you go. <laughs> You're missing you're, you're missing some of Marina Marino's corn. Oh yeah, yeah, the corn. That's a big deal. Lean on me is in Bellingham. Okay. Well, I hate to tell you I'm now going to open mail. So there, Steve. So there. <coughs> oh. Because oh. I can hear the corn board all boiling. There's one box right there. And you know what? You know what we need to start on? Is we need to start the spirit sticks. Oh, yeah. You got yourself a corn? I took some corn. Good. You got plenty. So um, on the way home. Yeah, I'll eat it on the way home. You can. You probably could. You could. Yeah. Do. Yeah, we need to start the spirit stick stuff. That'll give us a lot to play with at mail call. <clears throat> so for those of you who cannot make it to dog fest, Just you so can you start know. sending in your, your, your spirit sticks. That would be fun. Just so you know, you're not on camera. I'm not on camera. Oh, yeah, you got to adjust. Oh. Because you were on chaos. Chaos got her nails trimmed. There you have the whole crowd. Okay, this is for Dog Fest. It closes my check for three of us for Dog Fest. We'll put it all in the three sisters. Thank you. Lois Blackburn. It goes into the pot. There we go. That's done. Next one. Next one. R. Farrington. Rutland, Mass. Rutland? Yeah, maybe. That'd be all right. Every once in a while, I cut a letter in half, which I may have done this time. No, not quite. Okay. Rutland, Mass. Okay, that's an applicant -y sort of thing. I do like to kind of look them over, but you can have the envelope. You don't need to put the address down, just, just, just behave yourself. Mm -hmm. Kathy, Mira, Phil Larica. Who, what? Phil Larica. Phil Larica. <laughs> right up the road here. That's a local person. In honor of Bill Mullen. That's another one. We have, we have a lot of checks coming in in honor of Bill Mullen. You can have that, and that goes in the pot. And we have Donor View, Westboro Matt, Executive Director. That'd be me. Just for lack of anybody else. AKA occupant. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> the most comprehensive nonprofit software. What do you need nonprofit software for? 
Because it's comprehensive. Oh, it's Unbelievable. Increase insight. Serve more efficiency. Improve loyalty, speed, and accuracy. Maximize outreach. Better communication. Maximize revenue. Reduce your cost. I don't. I don't know. Then and they'll take a small fee for it. I'm sure. We'll suffer along like we're going, right? Mm -hmm. This one I don't know who this one's from. It's fat. <coughs> Amnesty. I don't. Okay. I'm not going to do that. Okay. And we have. Well, it would be fun to start having spirit sticks. Getting a couple, right? Uh, we have a couple. Yeah, we have a couple. And we have some poop pickers. And you can have this. This is from Carol Field, Osterville, Massachusetts. There you go. And, oh, look at this. Here we go. Holy a grudge is letting someone live rent-free in your head. Oh, God. Yep. That's not bad. That's not a bad one. You have? Yeah. I don't have that one. A positive attitude may not solve all your problems, but it will annoy enough people to make it worth the effort. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Vegetables are a must for a diet. I suggest carrot cake, zucchini bread, and pumpkin <laughs> pie. <laughs> Nothing will ruin your 20s more than thinking you should already have your life together. Mm. A man is not old until he regrets to take the place of his dreams. Wait a minute. A man is not old until his regrets take the place of his dreams. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, it was hard to figure out. Ask not what you can do for your country. Ask what's for lunch. <laughs> Life must be lived forwards. You can only be understood backwards. Huh. Okay. Well, those are wonderful. We'll have a good time reading those when we pick and poop. Pick and poop. Carlene, that's me. You have that one. Who knows where you'll be for this mail call? Maybe <laughs> Puppy Hills or the Donkey Barn. Maybe in the arena. Whoa. Such fun. And Mo was just stunning in the harness that took a village to pull, pull that off and under your directions. We love you all and we're so appreciative of everything you do. Carol and Betty from Cape Cod. They like three chicken bricks. You got them. We put it in there. And hope Donham gives them to you. There we go. And then that goes in the pot. <coughs> Wonderful. Now, these are for Jade and Haley and Laura. Laura's taking two weeks off. She said she'd probably come back in two weeks to volunteer, but she is taking off for the summer because she's realized that life has gotten serious. She has to go to work and go to school now. Don Johnson. It's called The Last Hurrah. Yeah. Uh. I don't even want to look at it. We'll give it to Linda. That's the insurance stuff. Okay. And we have here, there. I put this thing in my desk and it slid in with a great deal of difficulty. I thought, well, I'll just slide it back a little bit more. Now it's married. It has married my desk drawer. There is no pushing it back at even an eighth of an inch, which is really too bad because the, the anti machine doesn't quite fit in there. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to survive. We will survive. And this is from Joyce Houston, Pennsylvania. 
<clears throat> Did we ever thank Joyce for that dinner we had last night? I mean, Saturday night or whenever it was? We may not have. Joyce, thank you for dinner Saturday night. Well, she was down at, oh, it was your dinner. Wasn't it your, wasn't it your birthday dinner? Oh, that's Joyce. That Joyce. Yeah. This is it, this, that's that Joyce. Because this is a different Joyce. Yeah. <clears throat> this one is, I can't pronounce Joyce that. Houston. Regalsville. I don't know if that's right. Nobody's going to make fun of me for that one. Pennsylvania. Somewhere in Pennsylvania. Somewhere in Pennsylvania. Hopefully, uh, non <clears throat> And this is to Carlene. That's me. Then i got to get the old beer out again. Ah. It's a little crowded in that front of that door. What did you want to do? Ah, uh, dear Carlene, I've enclosed a bunch of poo pickers. And treats for the dog, two doggy toys, and a check for 10 chicken bricks. Well, isn't that wonderful? What's in there? 10 chicken bricks, isn't that? That's beautiful, that's lovely. I have just watched video of Bella and George. What a wonderful video and pictures. Certainly shows how much training the dogs can help people who need them. I have gotten your service dog project information to a few people that I know would benefit from your dogs in hopes they will contact you. Sincerely, Joyce Houston. Well, isn't that nice? Thank you, Joyce. Thank you, Joyce. And that got to go into the chicken brick stand. Did you want to carry this around? You got it. That's not what you wanted, is it? Oh, look at that. Oh, isn't that cute? This is a this is a deep plastic thing. Yep, toss it over. There we go. Yep. We made it. <coughs> Look at them all. Bentley's head just came up and the ears are perfectly straight. <laughs> and we have poo pickers. And we have we have some doggy treats. Isn't that wonderful? Okay, you can carry these that way. I'm on the downhill. Oh. <coughs> I'll take those with me. I can play with those. Ugh. Oh. Okay, I did it. <clears throat> oh no, where are we? This one? SDP web? What? What are you trying to do? Find comments. Oh, okay, yep. Try uh Yep. I want your slide. <coughs> Does this one move? <laughs> <laughs> Huh, those are cute. No, hold on. Mm -hmm. Oh, I bet you're in Safari, aren't you? That got me. No, we got comments. We got comments? Okay. Hey, play nice. Let's see. What do we got? Excuse me. What yep. are you doing? Finding the comments. Oh, go ahead. Okay, we got chaos is still on camera. Right. We knew that. <clears throat> okay, I'm being a picture pest today. However, there were some terrific photos of Tanner and Steve at an amusement park near Mount Hood. Anyone know a quick way to pull them up? I want to show someone, but not sure who posted them. I haven't a clue. No. I would not have a clue. Let's see. Maybe scroll back through the chat. They're probably still in the basement somewhere. You got a toy? <laughs> yeah, got a toy. Did you get the three missing boxes from yesterday? Yes. Is that the ice cream? Yes. The important stuff? 
Who said? I'm trying to remember who sent it. Whoever sent it, it was lovely lunch. It was good lunch. Yeah, somebody asked, how was, how was lunch. the lunch? Yes, the lunch was excellent. Lunch was excellent. Hello everyone. Question. My dog is diabetic and going blind quickly. What are your thoughts on cataract surgery for dogs? And do you know anything about these eye drops can see that they say safely reverse cataracts in dogs? Any helpful tips or information shared would be very much appreciated. Thank you and keep up the great work, Dog Bus. I don't know. I don't know. I... How blind? Total blindness? Or just going partially blind? Yeah, it doesn't say. Dogs can deal with a lot, especially with a very old dog. With a very old dog, you always have the problem of anesthesia. Mm -hmm. You can get into more trouble with anesthesia than you can get into if they're going to run into a chair once in a while, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm very hesitant to operate on a very old dog. Have you ever heard of the eye drops? I never heard of them. Never heard of them. Your veterinarian would know about it. Or call your call your regular people doctor, eye doctor. Why don't they have it for people doctor? People dog, eye, yeah, whatever. Yeah. Pictures of Asher and uh, Seagram. <clears throat> Carlene did pronounce Regalsville, Pennsylvania correctly. Oh even though I probably didn't spell it correctly. <laughs> <laughs> I skip over letters, that's a, as we all know. Yeah, your, yeah, how was your gourmet lunch from Zing Zingerman's? It was good. It was good. Where is Zingerman's? I, they seem to be all over. They seem to be in Boston. Yep. In, in Chicago they, and strange places like, you know, St. Louis and I New York. Your mail order is out of Michigan. Michigan, I knew it. Some place like that that's really weird. Oops, there we go. Are we boiling the water? Yep. What? We're having a baby. Yes, they're boiling water. I could just do with some ears of corn and then I'd go to bed. Someone said, Carlene, he and Tanner have bungee jumping and zip lining and looking at Mount Hood. That's a beautiful mountain. It okay. is. Carlene, maybe you can find the hose for the stove from the book from Penn. From what? The Lancaster oh. book, maybe? Oh, Pennsylvania? Yeah. Hose know. for the stove? Yeah, hose. Yeah, it's got a hose. It's the a pipe. Oh, pipe. oh, the, the stove pipe. The stove yeah. pipe. Well, I'll look through that. <clears throat> I did order it already. I did find some, but I, I never thought of looking in there. That could, that could be too. Did you find the right size? I found five. Yep. If we got four and three quarter inch coming off the thing on the outside, we could take a five inch and slice it with scissors and then put one, one of those those, bands. those those bands that you screw up and again get tight. Uh -huh. And that should work. How is Sage in ICU? As far as I know, she's fine. Is she's acting fine. I didn't see anything wrong with her. I, I didn't think that bit. she was out on Flatfield. Huh? I think she was either on Flatfield or Puppy Hill at one point today. Hmm. What was her issue? Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Flood in the stool. Oh. Click on Coco, my K9 CP in the comment section, and you can see all the pics she has brought over for us from Facebook. Well, there you go. Yeah, she's very good about that. Thank you, David, for all your response. Much appreciated. You're welcome. Jody, you look exhausted. <laughs> we got a lot of I'm miles out of Jody. The moment. <laughs> yeah, it's been a little rainy around. A lot of showers. Boy, did it rain. Oh, it poured about an hour ago. Mrs. David, here is a point of pondering for dearest Carlene and all. If is smack dab in the middle of life in more ways than one, meaning one cannot go through life without saying if, I, what if, 
etc. And the spelling L I F E, if is in life. Huh. Penguin hugs every day, <laughs> everyone. Huh. Okay. <clears throat> All right, anything else? Oh, we got one more. Is there going to be a tug of war with Mo at the Janine thing? We're going to try it. Is it going to be on camera? Oh, yeah, it'll be on camera. Okay. It'll be should, on camera. Should be interesting. If, it, if it's rainy, we may have to move the whole operation into the arena, which is going to be very awkward. But uh -huh. I'm hoping it'll be out in the regular parking lot. Any training today? Oh, I grabbed... Paula by the tail as she went out the door. We had a serious discussion about running out the door uh -huh. until she's told to. That any, was my training episode of the day. Any more basket work? No. 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 We went to a we went to a nursing home today. Oh. It's very yeah. nice. People were very nice there. Very appreciative. Where was this one? In Danvers. Danvers. Too late. Leahy? Then I went and gave a blood sample at Leahy. Oh, I thought it was because you were exhausted. <laughs> <coughs> My dog no, has. Wait a minute, it, it's tiring to do that nursing home thing. I bet it is. Because so. it's, <coughs> I just sit there, but I am absolutely alert. Mm -hmm. You're watching. I had, we had three dogs with us. Who'd you bring? Bentley and Sizzle, yep. the pros. She's a good girl. And we had Mo with us, May with us. Me. But to keep track of all of those things and figure how they're thinking, and, and Sizzle, Sizzle's very good, and so is, so is Bentley. There was a guy there that Sizzle didn't like. Really? Yeah, she didn't like him. There's always someone. And so I had to be extremely careful that she just didn't run over my <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think she would, but... It, you know, you could just tell her, her head would come up and she'd look. And she'd stand very still. So she was telling me, there's something wrong with that guy. Which was, you know, he he probably was Alzheimer's and he was shuffling along very, very slowly. So he did look strange, but heaven only knows what they pick up. Yeah. Heaven only knows. David, are you going to the donkey thing? Awesome Annie, Jody, I will not be there. Teacher Dawn should be there. Uh, I don't think she's here yet for it. I don't think she gets in until Sunday. Nope, she's not here until right. Sunday. I don't think I'm going to be making it. No. Carlina, you got to be there? I apparently will be. Is Bentley okay? He hasn't been showing up for mail call when dog biscuits arrive. He's tired. He's, he's tired. He's right. tired. He worked hard they, today. He worked hard. And so did Thizzle. She was a good girl. Okay. Uh, we got a couple more here, I think. Jeez, oh, almost fell off. Taking Mo to a retirement home. <laughs> that would be interesting. Ha 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 ha. I wouldn't say that. <clears throat> I took Mary to a retirement home. You did? She did? Oh, God, yes. Yes, we had duct tape on our feet. There was a great big, <laughs> great big um, auditorium-y sort of place where everybody sat in a big circle. It was a big room. It was the size of a basketball court. They were sitting in a circle. And I just turned Mo, uh, Mary loose in there, and we passed around a frying pan, and she would follow that frying pan around the whole place. And mm -hmm. she, Never did a thing that was wrong. Hmm. That would be different. What kind of dog paperwork do you need to go into nursing homes? They like us. <laughs> well, so with service dogs, they are the ultimate of training. Mm -hmm. So there, there'd be no trouble. Um, Wasn't there one you used to go to when they what, started Danny, getting? Uh, yes. And they decided they wanted all sorts of paperwork, and I said, thank you, no, yeah. thank you, because I, there's no way I'm going to have stool samples done on all these dogs every single month. Oh. Give me a break. Say. They're on mm -hmm. pills. Forget yeah. it, you know. They're going to get as many germs in that nursing home as they're going, yeah. as they're going to carry in. 
What? You know who's still what's... in the hospital with a bite is Colleen. She really got bit. She really got bit. Oh no. What'd you say? I think she said the corn is done. Oh. <laughs> I thought she said something about Colleen. <clears throat> what's for dinner? Corn. Is Colleen out? She got out today. Yay. Oh, good. good for her. What's for dinner? Fresh corn on the cob. And a chicken and rice dish. Chicken and rice dish? Mm. All right. Is it ready? About 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Yeah. Okay. Quick, ask more questions. <laughs> <clears throat> What's for dessert? Well, there's lots of ice cream. Ice cream. Oh. Mm. And some wonderful. Cookies, frosted cookies. Oh, oh, oh the Cheryl's. Cookies. They're so good. <laughs> oh, so good. Somebody brought in some <clears throat> some smaller cookies that weren't too bad today either. Oh, we got another. Dear's I think Carlene. it was Washer's owner. Wash oh, that's right, yeah. Washer's owner was here. Yep. Washer's apparently Chocolate. done a really good job for Chocolate her. The chip? Yes. Dear Scarlene, as to the retirement home visits, did you guys work out the feed me, aka lunch as payment? Not, not to this one. We had to be there at ten fifteen. But I did mention the fact that we were more inclined to show up if we got fed. <laughs> Great job on the stove, Jody. Oh, thank you. She did. It's a really good job. Haley, Haley's doing a good job. Haley, you've got me. you smile on the camera for a little while here? There she is. She's running the barn at the moment. How is it going? Um, it's good. The donkeys um, are all set. They eat so much hay, I never realized. Because oh, yeah. <laughs> I've filled all their bags, like, more than twice today. Really? <laughs> so, okay. Yeah, I was very surprised. It Wait. is possible to get almost a bale in some of those bags. Yes. And they just go on. Okay. Yeah. My okay, how's, the, how's the dog for you? with the diarrhea? Did you clean up after that one at all? Or is it the Sage. ICU house? Sage. Somebody else. Um, Sage. I didn't clean up after. Okay, ice. but you have no report to give no, me. No, I do that, not. Huh? Okay. Anything Sorry. else I should know about? How's the, how's Pe Pe Penny doing? She's Penny? doing great, she? I think. Good. Um, she she doesn't out? whine at all. She walk on leash really well. I do not know. Why don't you try and see what happens? I will. In your spare time. <laughs> Tomorrow, I will. Okay. okay, she may flip over backwards. You know. you know, the problem when they start backing up into that thing is if you go with them, you're chasing them. Right. From their standpoint. That it's, makes sense. It's, it's an awful situation to be in, <clears throat> but your best thing to do is to try and stand still and not go toward them. You think if I go toward them, I'll release it on their neck. No, they'll just run backwards further. You know, so just stay there. Pull them pull forward and let it go a little bit, but don't go toward them because that's, they are chasing them. That's, that's bad. <laughs> it's tough. She did it today, so I know they're not really, I know they're not really good at it yet. So, okay. Well, have a good night. You want some corn to go? I'm all set. CPs say, hope you had a good birthday. Thank you. Oh, did you get a, she got a card. Did you get a card? Yes, she Linda did. has it. Linda has it. Yes. Okay. Yes, yeah, someone asked, what was Colleen bit by? Bit by a dog. A small dog at her grooming station, yeah. someone answered. Small dog. Small dog. Big bite. No, it wasn't even a big bite. It was just yeah, where it Yeah, it doesn't landed. take much, yeah. It went into a bone. Yeah. Bacteria. Mm-hmm. Blue Penguin says, happy birthday yesterday, Haley. Thank you. <laughs> um, and I think it was Blue's birthday yesterday. Was it your birthday? Happy birthday. A lot of birthdays around lately. Well, that could be it. Okay. All right, get ready for Bye, dinner. Bye, everybody. All right. Have a good night, everyone. Thank you.